business, I think, in general, has tended to be quite narrow in the way it's deemed success. As a co-op, we've focused on um, different aspects, and, and I think these aspects are going to become more and more relevant for business in general. It's not going to be enough just to deliver shareholder return. I think it's going to be the responsibility of businesses and their CEOs to demonstrate the effect that they're having on growing local communities, um, making them more prosperous, sharing more of the wealth they create and putting it back into localism. My observations, having joined the business six years ago, was that we wrongly had thought that we needed to be more like a PLC. We'd forgot what being a co-op was all about. So I've um, been quite uh, directive and forceful around getting back to our past, taking what the pioneers used to do 175 years ago, it's our birthday this year, but giving it a modern twist. Um, we're a co-op today where the more value that we create, the more good we can do. We, I think as well documented, had a difficult, challenging period. We rescued the co-op, we rebuilt it, we're still rebuilding it, but that gave permission to set a new agenda, to take us back to a different way of doing business. But I doubt an approach which sees social responsibility as an add-on is going to be enough to address this reinvention called for recently by the French finance minister. I believe the needs of business should chime true with the needs of wider society. Are you treating your suppliers fairly? Are women and minority groups getting fair opportunities to progress and lead? Are you responsible about paying conditions throughout your business? Are you measuring and reducing the impact of your business on the global climate? people do recognise the need for a more cooperative, cooperating style of business. And that sits very much in the heart of communities. And a year ago, we launched an ambition which said stronger co-op, stronger communities, which said you have to be commercially strong, but you also need to make sure that you're focusing into local needs and communities and putting back something rather than taking it away. One of the things that we've learnt when we talk to students is they absolutely love the co-op model. It resonates with them, they trust it, they're very sceptical of big business. We didn't need Blue Planet to tell us that there was a real issue about packaging. We, we moved away from plastic cotton buds nearly 20 years ago, as an example. We'll be the only one out there with a compostable carrier bag. No one's done that, but rather than say it's ours, we want to give the technology to anybody else. PLCs are working out that they sh need to think wider in terms of their overall performance. And for a co-op where this is a natural thing for us to do, we're encouraging others to do it. We don't see this as a competitive edge. We clearly, I think, are ahead of the pack on it, but I would encourage all businesses to do this because I think it's the right thing.